Human enhancement can be really anything, from a cup of tea to performance enhancing drugs to an exosuit or to the eradication of disease through gene editing. We are at the point of realizing we are technologies that drive us beyond our human capabilities. The manipulation of our bodies and minds through additional hardware, such as for example through implants or novel prosthetics, modification of our genes through new gene editing tools and knowledge and biotechnologies, basically the manipulation of our own biological mass. Then thirdly, through manipulations on a molecule pharmacological levels for novel drugs that drive us beyond capabilities that we could before cognitive, uh, cognitively reach, for example, as well as through manipulation of our environment in which we live that can boost our performance and improve the quality of our life. That's a fusion of engineering, nanotechnology, advanced materials, artificial intelligence, robotics, that all comes together. But we really need to bring them all at one table to engage the public in this discussion. And what we're trying in the, in the Council on the Future of Human Enhancement is to define the technologies and their goals and to identify the associated risks and even before things could even go on the market or disseminate, guide all stakeholders in academia and industry and government to minimize the risk of negative side effects and impact.